Hey there guys and welcome back to Prototype. In the last episode we were handing out free helicopter rides to soldiers. Yeah, it was kind of a lame episode. So what are we going to do now? Mercer, right now Blackwatch's only motivation is building the blood tox weapon as far and wide as possible. They're already moving to blanket the island with it. And once they have you boxed in, they'll move in for the kill. You need to break their grip on southern Manhattan before they can expand their coverage radius. Who the hell is this? Yeah, I'm sure we'll figure out who the hell that is in due time. So, yeah, they're planning to kill me. Blood tox breaks down anything infected with the virus. Dispersed through the air, it's like a modern-day Agent Orange. Oh boy, time for a history lesson. If I recall correctly, Agent Orange was... a sort of... chemical that they used in the Vietnam War to kind of kill all the plant life in the jungle with, so they could see all the Vietnamese soldiers hiding in the jungle or something. Pretty sure that's what Agent Orange is. I'm not entirely sure, it's been a while. Although I did have to, uh... learn all about the Vietnam War for my... final exams in history in high school. Then again, that was more than 30 years ago. So, I'm probably wrong. Or I'm right, and I'm just not knowing it, I'm kind of doubting my own abilities. Which I tend to do. Anyway, those things are spreading the blood tox all around. And we need to destroy them. However, we most likely need to get within range of those things to destroy them. And, nope, my arm's not long enough. Looks like I'm gonna have to get closer. Now, pretty sure this is... Possible with the whip fist? Is that one over there? Oh no, that's just a water tower. I eh, might as well break those as well. I mean, they're there. They're freaking hideous. And there's hunters growing in most of them, so there's no reason not to destroy them. And go. Okay, they haven't detected me, and that hit the roof. Oh no, I don't want to accidentally hit the chopper and give away my position. And they're still unaware of my presence. Nice. Okay, that rooftop's clear. Time for some stealth action. Oh, should have charged it a little more, I guess. And die. They're like, oh shit, this giant black tentacle just came from up that building there. And no one's bothering to see where it came from. Even though it should easily be able to be traced back to its origin. Or source, or whatever. Anyway, the gig's up, I'm busted. And still, I want to kill you because you gave away my position, you asshole. Okay, moving on to the next blower. Probably up that building there. Do we have anything useful? Oh, we'll have some health. Gonna take the long way around. I'm gonna see over how big of an area they've spread those things. And just take on a disguise and that they don't know I'm here anymore and we can go back to doing this Metal Gear style mm -hmm. he's pretty far away well I'm pretty sure that that one is the one that's the furthest away from like it's at the edge of the area those things are in and it is not there it's down on the street I guess Oh crap, soldiers. Eh, I need to do this carefully. No, I don't want to lose my disguise. Ooh, this is going to be bad. Alright, whip fist. Sweet, I got two with one blow. Perfect. And I'm disguised again. You die. I think that was a soldier at least. Oh, a rocket launcher. That'll... Oh, they're blowing up a hive. Well, it makes sense to put one of those... Blood Tox Blower is right next to a hive, because the hive is infected and thus would be killed by that thing. And I just blew up something that wasn't the detector. Or a blower. The hell am I talking about? Pay attention, man. It's been a long day at college. I'm tired. Have to do this before I go to bed. Oh crap, helicopter. And... Oh crap, he didn't even see me. And he still hasn't seen me. And now he will never see me again. Alright, next blower. 
Let's go up. Work through this systematically. That's another water tower. I have no qualms against destroying those. They're messing up my targeting, so they need to die. And look, there was a hunter inside. We just killed a baby. Sure, it's a giant, pink, freakish monster baby, but still. Now, is that thing... Yeah, it's up on that building. Alright, going up. Don't need an elevator. I can run faster than any elevator ever can hope to go. And... Jeez, it's kind of draining my health really fast. Also, there's some of these big muscle men up here trying to disturb my progress. And I'm not too keen on that. Now, what I wonder is, they might be as strong as a hunter, but can they climb up buildings as well as a hunter? Because I'm pretty sure I just knocked both of them off. Oh, no, that one's still here. Already climbed back up already. No, let me go. Oh, crap. How did I press the wrong button? Square is attack. I was pretty much pressing square already. The hell? And, no, let me go. Keep your hands to yourself. And go down. Honestly, though, why do they think that super strong soldiers will work against Alex? Like, why put money into researching that? Why not, like, put money into researching better weapons? Like, you have the uh, blood tox vaccine thing poison. Why not turn that into, like, a dart gun or something and just try to shoot Alex with it? Kinda makes more sense to me. But oh well, it's like, oh, we have super strong enemies for the player to fight, so it's a genius idea. It doesn't matter that it doesn't make any sense in regards to the story. Let's just go ahead and do it. Yeah. Alright, there's another one. And Rooftop is once again in the way. Come on. There we go, one more. They don't even know... Jeez, the alert meter didn't even go up. They're just shooting rockets at something, and I'm just here destroying their things. It's okay with me. Next one. Let's go over there. Or over here, there's one close by, next to that hive. A lot of hives in this place. I guess that's what you get if the city is slowly going to hell. And Oh, crap. Just the things I didn't want to see. Now, did that thing come out of the hive, or did it break out of a water tower? I'm pretty sure I killed that one before it hatched. Yep, still see only one hunter. Oh crap, there's another one. Wow. Oh crap, there's a third one. And a fourth. Where do these things keep coming from? I guess they're being crapped out by the hive. Looks like I need to destroy that. Or not, just kill him and move the hell on. Sounds like a better plan. Don't want to waste any time. And die, die, die. Dash attack's pretty useful against them as well. Oh, come on, don't lie down. And... Kesslice. Yep, you're dead. Now. There is one right up this building. Let's go and do that. No, that's a water tower. Yeah, that's a water tower. Let's just go and do this. Did I get it? I think I got it. Yep, I got it. That sword dive doesn't really have that great... Like, movement to it. Like the dive kick, you can pretty much just shoot straight ahead at any enemy. The sword drop thing doesn't really do that. Kind of a bummer, but... It's insanely strong, and if it was pretty much homing as well, it would just be really, really broken. So I can see why they didn't do it. And helicopter go down. Or was that a helicopter? Could have been one of those UAV things. And what is that I'm targeting now? It doesn't seem to be taking a lot of damage, so I'm guessing it's a tank. I don't really want to be dealing with tanks here. So, there's one right beneath me, and pretty sure I'm targeting it now. Oh crap, my targeting's messed up. Need to lock on, on on that thing again. Come on, please. Okay, let's just first destroy that thing, because it's messing up my targeting. Screw you, water tower. Alright. Can I just get a bead on the blood tox blower thing? If it's moving, I know I'm not supposed to be targeting it. 
And I can see where the gas is coming from. So I just need to aim it. No, I don't want to lock on on the freaking tanks. Okay, let's just go and do it like this. Banzai! That oh, works pretty well. Destroys those things in one hit. Target uh, fully charged whip fist took at least two hits. And next one is right over here. <clears throat> let's go and... Yep, see, it doesn't really have very good movement to it. Alright, go up. Go down. Another one bites the dust. That leaves only three more. On the minimap. I'm pretty sure it says six out of eight in the top right there. But there's still three things on the minimap, so I'm kind of confused. Oh well. Here is another one, and enemies are really swarming after me. But... Yeah, if I can just do this before they kill me. No man, super soldiers, tanks. This is such a mess. And I'm just hovering in midair and they can't even hit me. Crappy aim is crappy, tanks. Alright. Take to the rooftop so they can't get me there. Unless if they have helicopters. You know what? I want to feel, feel like hijacking one. That's going to be really helpful. Because the super soldiers can't get at it, I'm sure. It allows me to get to the final thing pretty fast. And I might just be able to blow it up from the sky. Alright. Oh crap, building! Ooh, that was close. What? What the hell was shooting at me? Pretty sure nothing was. Or did I have another chopper? Oh yeah, there's several choppers on the minimap. Crap, I'm almost dead. Come on, just break this thing. No, don't grab me. Don't grab me, damn it. Leave me alone. I'm gonna tell on you if you keep grabbing me like that. Alright, I'm done. Oh crap, I still need to evade the military. All right, run like hell! I got a damn it helicopters bombing me from above. Just run, Alex. Just run, and switch and mission complete. All right, that went pretty well. A hundred and ten thousand experience points. Nice. Now the world set free. Go to the contacts phone booth. All right, I will do that in the next episode of Prototype. First, we'll beat up some civilians because we haven't done that in a while. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you later.